The Horizon class is the most capable surface combatant of the French and Italian navies. It can carry more Aster missiles than any other warships in service for these countries and offers unprecedented enhanced survivability. As the weapon detective, when now investigating the Horizon class, the protector of the carrier groups in French and Italian navies against air threats. The classification of the Horizon class is a little bit confusing. The Italians define the Classe Horizonte as a destroyer, while the French called Classe Horizon a frigate, even though they use the NATO classification D intended for destroyers. On the other hand, if you look at its mission definition, we could say that it is simply an anti-air warfare destroyer. Let's continue as such. Western countries executed many successful joint programs in military aviation in the 1960s. These achievements naturally gave them the courage to collaborate on naval projects. Thus, they established a research group in 1979, and within two years, feasibility studies began for NATO frigate replacement for the 90s, also known as the NFR-90 program. However, the eight participant countries – Canada, France, Germany, Italy, the Netherlands, Spain, the UK and the USA – had different agendas and requirements, and the partnership quickly dissolved. Still, the spirit of collaboration continued. France, Italy and the UK issued a joint requirement in 1992. In July 1993, the three countries signed a Memorandum of Understanding for a Common New Generation Frigate or CNGF. This ship would be armed with the principal anti-air missile system or PAAMS, which later became Aster Air Defense Missile Family. The initial plan was promising. The UK would acquire 12 ships to replace its Type 42 class destroyers. France planned to have four to replace its Suffren class destroyers, and six would be constructed for Italy to replace its Andrea Doria class cruisers and Audace class destroyers. Yet again, operational requirements of these countries did not match. Besides, London, Paris, and Rome could not agree on many subsystems and shares of industrial cooperation. The five year delay was the final nail in the partnership's coffin. Therefore, the UK withdrew from the project in 1999 in favor of the national Type 45 class destroyer project. Still, France and Italy continued their collaboration under the Horizon project. In September 2000, the two countries decided to jointly build four ships, two for each, to replace their Audace and Suffren class carrier escorts. They were highly advanced, which also made them too expensive. Therefore, France and Italy, which initially planned to have two more Horizon class destroyers each, terminated the project. The French Navy has continued with a modified Fram class frigate variant for anti-defense roles and the Italian Navy is now working on a new destroyer. The first French ship, Forban, was laid down on April 4, 2002 and launched on March 10, 2005. In 2008, she was delivered to the French Navy for trials. However, her commissioning was delayed until October 14, 2010 to complete the combat management system and PAAMS integration. The second and last French ship, Chevalier Paul, joined the fleet in 2011. The first Italian destroyer, Andrea Doria, was laid down on July 19, 2002, launched on October 15, 2005 and commissioned on December 22, 2008. The second and last Italian ship, Caio Duglio, joined the fleet in 2009. The 152.9 meter long Stealthy Horizon class had a radar signature equivalent to a trawler approximately 20 meters. All major equipment is raft mounted and most machinery parts are installed in soundproof cabinets to reduce the acoustic signature. To enhance the ship's survivability, the propulsion system is located in two machinery rooms, one in the bow area and the other in the stern. Additionally, a bubble device diminishes hull and propeller noise. This design also helps absorb the blast of a possible underwater explosion. Before being released, the hot exhaust gases are mixed with cold air and cooled to lower the infrared signature. The ship is divided into 12 watertight sections. A 15-meter breach or several submerged sections can be managed without compromising navigability. A double bulkhead and a cover dam also divide the hull into two areas to improve firefighting and anti-flooding characteristics. Moreover, the destroyer is divided into several firefighting zones to increase survivability. 
The double-skinned hull can partially withstand the impact of a torpedo or missile and is fully resistant to heavy machine gun rounds. The CIC also has armored protection. Many subsystems are duplicated to maintain functionality in the event of a hit. The Horizon class can operate in a CBRN environment. The destroyer has a 740 horsepower bow thruster which facilitates port operations. The biggest shortcoming of the Horizon class is its poor land attack capability. Yet the ship has space for two additional 8-cell Silver A-70 vertical launching systems allowing for the launch of MDCN cruise missiles. The Horizon class possesses anti-roll stabilizers to improve sea keeping. It also allows helicopter operations up to sea state 6. Its flight decks are 26.5 meters long and 20 meters wide. The French ships use the Samaya handling system and operate an NH-90 NFH Kaimo helicopter. Italy prefers the semi-automatic assist handling system and the SH-101A or SH-90A helicopter. In June 2023, France and Italy signed a Memorandum of Understanding confirming cooperation on the medium-term modernization of the Horizon class. The modernization includes replacing the MPAR and S-1850M radars with the Kronos Grand Naval and Smart L MMN. The ship will also gain the Aster Block 1 anti-missile launching capability allowing it to engage ballistic missiles within a range of up to 150 kilometers. In 2024, the French Navy decided to equip its Horizon-class ships with Safro Passio XLR electro-optical systems to increase their engagement capability against missile and drones. According to Jane's Fighting Ships 2015-2016 edition, the complement of the Horizon-class is 195 people. The ship has a length of 152.9 meters a beam of 20.3 meters and a drought of 8 meters. Its standard and fully loaded displacements are approximately 5,790 and 7,160 tons respectively. The combined diesel or gas propulsion system comprises two 31,015 horsepower Fiat Avio GE LM 2500 gas turbines and two 5,850 horsepower SEMT PL Stig 12PA 6SDC diesel engines. Its maximum speed is 29 knots. The Horizon class has a range of 6,100 nautical miles, in other words, 11,000 kilometers at a speed of 18 knots. The G-Van Empire 3 d surveillance and fire control phased array radar can detect targets, including hypersonic missiles, at a range of over 480 kilometers. It is difficult to jam or interfere with and can operate in intense clutter. The Empire also guides Aster missiles for medium or long-range air defense. It can simultaneously track up to 300 targets and engage 12 of them. The S-1850M is a modified version of the Smart L and can automatically detect and track up to 1000 targets at a range of 400 km. The Horizon class also has the UMS 4110CL sonar, which has active search capability between 4.6 and 6.1 kHz and passive search capability between 4.2 and 6.1 kHz. The guns on the ship are directed via the J-Band RTN-30X fire control radar. The Italian destroyers also have the I-Band SPS-791 surface search radars. The Horizon class is equipped with the I-Band SPN-753 navigation radar. The ship has a 48-cell Silver A-50 vertical launching system, which can launch Aster 15 and 30 air defense missiles. The anti-ballistic missile defense capable Aster 30 has a speed of Mach 4.5 and a maximum operating range of 120 km. However, its actual effective range is 20 km. Beyond this distance, the effectiveness of the Aster 30 begins to decrease geometrically. The Aster 15 air defense missile has a maximum operating range of 30 km, a speed of Mach 3 and a 15 kg warhead. Its actual effective range is 13 km. The French ships have 8 land attack capable MM40 Exocet Block 3C anti ship missiles with a maximum range of 180 to 200 km. They possess a 165 kg penetration warhead and a speed of Mach 0.9. The Block 3C variant integrates a digital radio frequency seeker into the missile, making it more resistant to jamming systems. The Italian destroyers have eight Teseo Mark IIa anti-ship missiles, which feature a range of 180 km, a speed of Mach 0.91 
and a 210 kg warhead. The French variants have two 76mm Super Rapidos. The gun has an effective range of 16 km and a rate of fire of 120 rounds per minute. Forban and Chevalier Paul are also fitted with two 20mm Nawal remotely controlled weapon stations. They have a rate of fire of 800 rounds per minute and an effective range of 1500 meters against aerial targets. The Italian version has three Stralis guns which can fire dart guided projectiles against aircraft and sea skimming missiles. It is currently the highest range barreled close in weapon system. The dart can perform 40G maneuvers and has an effective range of 8 km. Andrea Doria and Caio Duglio are also equipped with two 25mm KBA 2580 guns, which can fire 570 rounds per minute and have a range of up to 2 km. The Italian vessels also have two Stepmass CS424 acoustic guns. In 2023, Forban served as a test platform for the Elma P Naval Anti Drone Combat Laser System. The Horizon class has two 324mm fixed torpedo tubes for the MU-90 torpedo, featuring a 32.7kg shape charge warhead. Its maximum range is 23km and its maximum speed exceeds 50 knots. The MU-90 can engage a target at a depth of 1000m. Forban and Chevalier Paul participated in the 2011 military intervention in Libya. In 2024, France deployed them in the Red Sea against Houthi attacks. On August 22nd, Chevalier Paul evacuated and assisted the crew of the Greek tanker Sonion, which had previously been attacked by two armed boats. During the rescue operation, she also destroyed a naval drone with her 20mm Narval guns. Italy deployed Andrea Doria in the Indian Ocean for anti-piracy operations in 2011. She engaged in a brief action with pirates on November 22nd. One month later, the destroyer rescued the Cypriot merchant ship Pacific Express, which the armed pirates were seizing. In 2024, Italy also deployed its Horizon-class destroyer in the Red Sea against Houthi attacks. These vessels rotationally served as the flagship of the multinational task force in the region. On March 2nd, Caio Duglio shut down a Houthi drone launched using our 76mm main gun. It's not a top-secret matter why France and Italy have not ordered an additional two Horizon-class ships. These surface combatants are excessively expensive due to their high weapon-carrying capabilities and survivability. Furthermore, they are purebred anti-air warfare destroyers with limited ground attack capabilities. Current modern navies prefer general-purpose warships rather than mission-oriented designs. The Horizon-class is among the most potent surface combatants in Western European navies. However, alongside its high cost, the lack of a high-caliber naval gun and land-attack missile launching capability overshadows these destroyers. Still, seeing the Horizon class at sea gives us pleasure. Thanks for watching our video. And please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the bell button to be notified of our new videos. Also, you can now click the join button to support our channel. And as always, we would greatly appreciate all of your likes, comments and shares.